Good morning, good afternoon, good evening. I'm here with my chocolatey mint wife, Laura. Are you my chocolatey coffee husband, Nathan? Uh, I hope not. No. Hope. No. Nathan doesn't like coffee very much. Which is why... You're not, you're not looking forward to which this. Which is exactly <laughs> why we decided to review the new Cadbury Mad Mint and Craving for Coffee um, box. Yes. Uh, these are both special <clears throat> editions and you found these at Coles. Coles. Yes. No word yet on other supermarkets. We, this is the first place we I'm, saw I'm we them. I'm assuming So, uh, yeah, they don't say like exclusive or anything like that. Uh, so the interesting thing about these is they have four different types of the flavour in each. So the mint one has a, it's a, a creamy stuff in the middle. By the way, so sort of like a mention. snack block. Yeah, um, is original mint, uh, peppermint, choc mint, and spearmint. And on the coffee side, we have a flat white mocha, caramel latte, and an iced coffee. Um, neither of us drink coffee, but I don't mind coffee flavoured no. things as long as they're not <clears throat> overpowering. So, you know, this could go either way, I think, here. <laughs> I certainly hope it goes the right way. Do you want to try the coffee first um, so you can have the mint to, like, yes, please. wash away the flavour? <clears throat> right. I will mention something a little odd, is that they push these new limit uh, special editions out at the same time they're really pushing their new like smoothie. Oh, the dark milk and the, those varieties. Yeah, they, like the dark milk came out, they were advertising everywhere and now all of a sudden these just appeared in store with like, no advertising that we've seen at the point of filming. Yeah, so it's a little b bizarre on their timing, but... Yeah. Um, these are their peel and seal packs. Oh no, it looks like uh, we've got a bit of a breakage here. Alright, yes. So they this look pretty much identical yep. to the snack blocks. I'm assuming the four are going to be across like one I'm row. I'm certainly hoping so. Alright. We're going to be chocolate filled after this. So no idea which one is which. So, so I'm going to take a bite of this one first. I'll take a bite of this one. Mm. That one I've got. Oh, it smells just like coffee. Shall we? Mm. Mm. Um... I'm because I don't drink coffee. I think it's gonna be really hard to tell which one's which. There's mine with like the. Uh, are they the same color? They do look like the same. They're very similar. I don't know. Well, hang on. Let me. Mm. They are very similar looking. It's not a strong coffee flavor, by the way. The one I had anyway. Um. Oh. Mm. Different. They are different, yep. Oh, yours is horrible. Oh, I hate that. <laughs> I hate it. Nathan's one, I think... Tastes just more like regular cheap, like coffee, you get like coffee flavoured things, like a coffee mm. toffee. I'm not sure. I don't know enough about coffee to know which <clears throat> one's which. And the creams are almost the you know, like identical colour. <clears throat> Where's our stand? I was going to stand that back up. Um, do you want me to just try the other two? No, no, no. I'm, I'm happy to, to take a look <clears throat> for the team. Um, I think they're quite nice for like a coffee... <clears throat> Uh, flavoured thing, so I'm gonna try another one. Mm. Yeah, there's very little difference in the colour, and I don't think they correspond very well with uh, the pictures on the packaging either. Um, oh, that one's not very nice. The one I have, I think that's a flat white. It was kind of more of a a milky taste or oh, it could be the iced coffee i suppose hmm <laughs> i think that one's the best for me because it tastes least like it. yeah it tastes the least like coffee so maybe that's the iced one because you know that that ha factors in like ice cream and all that um well i don't get that chocolate hit that i get when i usually have cadbury chocolate <clears throat> no the coffee definitely like takes over oh i like that one. Oh, i think that's the mocha that last one that i just had Mmm. Mmm. Well, enjoy. Oh. Wow. Enjoy. Um, yeah, I don't mind those actually. Like, I'm a, again, don't drink coffee, but they're not too strong. Um, the chocolate's nice with it, but it, it it's more like a coffee flavour than chocolate. So if you're looking for just sort of more chocolatey, probably not for you. I but thought, if you love if you love coffee, yeah, I go for that it one. Was poo poo. <laughs> but then again, like I said, I'm really not a big fan of chocolate. Uh, <laughs> You hate coffee so much, you're getting confused between coffee and chocolate, hey? So, oop, the mint literally looks just the same. The same. There's no... I, I think we'll be able to tell these apart a little bit better. Um, it looks like the original mint is going to be the brightest green colour, according to the packaging. 
Mm. Well, you can definitely see the green. I would say according to the colour I've got the peppermint. No, that surely can't be peppermint. I would think that's spearmint. It's like a pale... I think I've just got mint. White. Alright, so I think that's the spearmint. And you think you've got original mint? Hmm. Mm. Hmm. Hmm. Yeah, I... I Oh, that's really strong, that one. That is a very strong mint. Yeah, that one Nathan had. Um, <clears throat> yeah, so that's either the spearmint or the original mint. The uh, bright green one. I think the problem with the mint and the, uh, compared to the coffee is all the mints taste very similar. They're all very minty. No, that one was really, really strong, though. Like, I'm not, I, 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 I never liked mint until after I had our second child, randomly. But that's too strong for me as a, as a not mint lover. <laughs> I think Hang that's, on, I haven't taken mine yet. I think that's peppermint. Hmm. Or chalk mint. Can't tell. I don't, I don't know anymore. This one just tastes like the first one I had. I'm getting confused now. Because that second one was so overpowering. Now I just have that minty burn in my mouth. The one you had was peppermint. The one I had was chalk mint, I think. Hmm. As in, the one I had first was chalk mint. Was spearmint. Uh, peppermint. Which one was chalk mint? The one you just had that I just gave uh -huh. you. Oh, it yeah. Doesn't, yeah. Yeah. The one I just had doesn't really taste too minty. Um, I don't really like those. Um, the reason being, that last one doesn't really taste that minty. Mm. And that other one tastes is too just minty. really, really strong mint. Um... And of course, you don't know which is which. <laughs> you can do it. You can make this video a drinking <laughs> game by taking a shot every time Laura says mint. Mint, mint, mint. Uh, um, so if you like mint, you'll probably like all of them. If you don't like mint, I would if, stay if away. If you like mild mint, probably don't. Because it's, it's don't a gamble. Do it. It's a one, yeah. one in four. You'll get something that'll blow your head off. And yeah. Coffee one, I think if you like coffee, it's probably not a bad one. Yeah, I think if you if, if you like any kind of coffee, you could probably go for that. Like it's not too strong. No. So yeah. I'm happier with the coffee one. I'm happier with the mint. Ta-da! If you enjoyed watching this video, give us a thumbs up. Let us know if you've seen either of these and what you thought if you have tried them. Uh, don't forget to hit subscribe and check out the link below to our uh, vlog and food review channel. Sounds good. Wait, this is the vlog and food review channel. You mean the review channel? <laughs> the review channel. We're filming where we film the reviews for Bird Poo Review. So check out the toy and board game channel there, down there, below. There, there, there. Uh, too much mint and coffee. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.